What's up, what's up, what's up boys and girls? Welcome to a brand new Let's Play here on my channel. My name is Plant Powers and this is Tales of the Neon Sea. So I've been waiting for this game for quite some time now. Especially for... Um, or mainly because of its pixel art. It's just stunning, it's beautiful. I've played the demo and I just... I was really sucked into it. So here it is, finally! So what is this game? Um, developed by Palm Pioneer and published by Zodiac Interactive. This is an adventure in the RPG game where we play as a has-been police detective, now private investigator, that uh, takes like odd jobs and uh, just uh, goes from mill to mill basically. We're in our uh, retirement days and whatnot and uh, we're just engulfed in this uh, very cyberpunk city and um, yeah I'm not, <laughs> not sure what else to say about it I'm just gonna go and jump into it because uh, I'm expecting a great game out of this so without any further ado let's uh, get into it just go uh, press any button to start the game all right new game So this is the controls, and I'm, I'm gonna be playing with a uh, a gamepad. So we should be. Oh, I've got to. Okay. All right, guys, do me a favor if you can, drop a like in the video, and if you're new to the channel, um, subscribe if you want to see more games like this. Alright, where on earth am I? My head feels like it's going to explode. Press smash A to get up. Alright. What? 2000? What? Weak. I am dead. Alright. It's <laughs> a great start to the game. Oh, we've got on the wall there. R1. Shift. What? Oh wait, it's coming for me. How do I run? Oh no, it got me again. How the hell do I run? It says R1, but I'm using a gamepad. I mean, uh, is that RB? Let me try this again. Oh yeah, yeah, it's RB, okay. Oh my god. Just run away from death. Go, 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 go. It looks like a... It's wearing a plague mask. Oh... Damn it. It hurts so bad. This is not good. My wrists and ankle are both in bad shape. That thing is unstoppable. It seems the hallucination has disappeared. But we could show up at any time. I better take care of my wounds quickly. I'm lucky to be alive. I reckon this fungus saved my life. It must have broken my fall after I dropped. Alright, cool. So we play as Rex. Uh, bizarre purple colored fungus is moving up and down almost like it's breathing. And as I mentioned before, we're a private detective. And I'm not sure what... Uh this fungus seems to be highly invasive and it's everywhere. My path seems to be blocked. Okay. And we'll come across as like puzzles and uh, things to investigate. But I don't want to spoil too much of it. So let's, let me just see what's this. There's no power, but the cable wire seems to be in good condition. Okay. Let me just go around and uh, explore a little bit of this area. Seems like we're in the sewers. The collision must have been bad, because I'm starting to see my hat running around by itself. Hmm, I need to get my hat back. Looks like this robot took a fall too. Looks like, seems like there's something... 
in our heads. I just turned this valve, I'm not sure what that... What does that do? Or that. Like any of these, for that matter. Um, let me try and switch this one on first. Hmm, the steam is carrying it away. That's it. I can use the valves to manipulate the steam. This little guy is gonna have to f the fright of his life. Okay, so now let's switch this up up here. And that should be going that way. Okay. Let me turn this initial valve again. Oh. I... Is it not going up there? It should. Okay, let me try the other way around. So, underneath here, and onto the blue pipe. This way around. And BAM! Nothing happens. <laughs> okay. Let me see what... What's this here? Ooh. There's also a door with a keypad, I think. I haven't recovered my hat yet. Okay. Definitely not leaving without my hat. I mean, come on. So this releases... Gas over there. I'm not sure... Uh... So we obviously have to get the steam to go onto that pipe there. I mean, I, th I would think... Like, this definitely doesn't do it, right? So we've got to turn it this way. Oh, right, there we go. That worked. So he's on... So obviously the we have to turn it this way now. So it doesn't release or escapes. And it should be turned on. It should be going... There we go. That's it. Now just this uh, last valve. Boom. Got you, baby. Thankfully, it hasn't been damaged. Or at least more than it already has. Or was. I just don't feel right without my hat. I mean, who does? Oh, who doesn't? Those electronic spores seem toxic. Better to stay away. Alright, let's go through the door, shall we? And look at this, look how much detail is there in this, like... Uh... Oh, wait! What the hell is that? It looks like a cat. Is that a cat? William? Is that you? <laughs> How did you get here? Go play somewhere else. The last thing I need is more trouble. Alright, so let's see. We're in some sort of garage. There's so much, so much going on on the screen right now. Oh, what's this? Electrical scissors, a little blunt, but still usable. Okay, we got those. Anything... Which one? Another one of those slimes. Was this a book? A discarded diary, probably left behind by a maintenance worker. Okay, we got a new file. Let me check. Where can we read those? Oh, it's here. Alright, cool. So we got some lore as well in the game. I didn't know that. Oh, that's pretty cool. So we got history, news, talk. Wait. Talk, case, and life. Okay. What's this? June 11th to 2118. Fine weather. After I finished the work assigned to me, I heard the staff talking about the government's big plan on developing and building the sky city. Sounds like a city floating in the sky. But what would even... What that... What would that even look like? Well, it's none of my business. I'm just an engineer robot. October 1st, cloudy. I have less and less work recently. I've noticed a small number of staff at the energy depot as well. When I was topping up, 
I heard lots of human staff have been sent to the Sky City under construction. I don't know whether I will be assigned to there as well. So this is obviously a robot talking here, writing in the diary. Oops. November 30th, 2019. Oh my... Oh, it's... Wait. It's going up now. The year is going... It's old. I don't know. The entry is a bit messed up, the order. Anyway. Anyways. Uh, the work is really drying up. And there, there are only three people working at the energy depot. I heard they left here because they are not good enough to go to Sky City. March 9th, 2020. Cloudy. The new job I've been given today is to clean the underground sewer. The work is going very slow because there isn't any professional equipment. July 19th, 2020. I am unable to return to ground with the requirement, uh, with the requirement time of the instruction center due to a GPS breakdown. I am trying to return by following the traces left in the waterway maintenance work. It sounds like... Robot was given a job here and then uh, he couldn't go back. This one, I guess? Hold on, let me just check uh, something else here. Have we got any more entries at all? We have history, none, news, it's empty as well. Case and life, they're, uh, they're empty as well. Okay. We have character files and everything is empty. Okay, sweet. So let's return. <laughs> I destroyed with a single blow. I don't want to know what happened here. Maybe it wasn't the robot that written that wrote that diary. I'm not sure. What's this uh, servo arm here? This must be the old plumbing maintenance station. If I can restore the power supply, I'll be able to repair my wounds temporarily. But I can't do anything until I find enough mechanical parts. Okay. Memo updates. Let me just check that. Investigate power equipment, acquire hand parts, acquire foot parts, and finish body restoration. Are we like a cyborg as well? Let me see if I can get... Uh, I'm not sure. don't think I can get foot part from that robot then. Let's see, what's this? I can't use this maintenance station until I find a way to power it. Okay. Let's check the cable. The cable is severed. I'll need to replace it. Okay. The generator is missing some power cells. I'll need to find an alternative source. Oh, I need to fill the generation the generator with alternative power cells. There must be something around here I can use. Okay, fair enough. Let me check these lockers then. Everything in there is broken. What's this? A power cell? Multifunction screwdriver. It can be used to dismantle machines, but it's all rusty. Alright, fair enough. Let's try and dismantle the other robot then. Maybe we can get some parts out of him. Uh, use? Wait. Oh, okay. It allows me to... Okay, okay, sweet. Mechanical ankle component, universal robotic ankle parts, classics from a bygone air age. Alright, sweet, so what else? We need a hand part and we need to finish, okay. Okay, I'm not sure if we can do... wait. Oh, we can put this here already? Yeah. Alright, sweet. Uh... Okay, let's, let me check the other area here. Maybe we can find something else here. Ooh, the cat has an idea. Oh, never mind that. We just eat a robotic mouse. Wait a second. This is the electronic storage pouch inside these cyborg rats. It's just what I need to help power the generator, but William has damaged it. Damaged this one with his teeth. I remember there are three slots in that generator, so I need to collect three electronic storage pouches at least. Meow meow? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I saw some rat holes near to where I fell. That'll be a good place to search. Okay, fair enough. Let's go hunt for rats. Let me check if I can... Can I go upstairs? I have no strength at all. I I'd be better attending to my wounds first. Okay, fair enough. Oh, 
Oh, there's another robot here. Maybe we can uh, get a hand from it? I think so. Professional mechanical wrist parts, the surface of which have suffered severe erosion. Sweet. Oh, there are tons of rats here. <coughs> Excuse me. That's just perfect. He scared away the cyborg rats. Now what am I supposed to do? Meow meow? What? You want to go in there and catch some rats for me? Meow meow. <laughs> Are you sure about this? You destroyed that last cyborg rat energy pouch with your teeth. I guess you're my only option. I need three more cyborg rats electronic storage pouches. Remember, you can't damage them. I'm counting on you. Oh, we are we gonna play with the cats? Yes, we are. Right, we need to catch them and not damage them. Inside the sewage pipeline 214010. What is that 10? October? Not sure. Okay, so Ah, uh, we have to sneak. Okay, nice. We have to sneak uh, from behind. I um, mean, so where does this lead? Oh. Oh, I think this is going to be difficult. Uh, oh, we know that. Jesus Christ. So many ways we could go. Could go. We can't go that way. We jump. Oh, we can jump here. Okay. Oh, we can't jump there. All right, let's go back. Level one, level three. Mirat. Oh, almost had him. And just clear the way here. So, okay, the shapes indicate uh, which holes I'm gonna come out of. Since there's three here, so. Oh, I can sneak on. Uh... Oh my goodness. I can sneak on this one. Oh, I got you, buddy. Oh, no, no, no. Off. Oh, I had to press. I had to press. Uh... A. No worries. I got him. I got him now. Noise. Oh no. Did I kill him? Oh, are you joking? Oh no, no. I got him. I got him. Okay. Energy crystal formed inside the cyber rats, which can be used as a replacement power source. Okay. Got one. Need three. Alright, let me check. Uh, how do I get down there? Uh, <laughs> Let me try this way. Oh, there's another one here. Gotcha. Wait, one more to go. Oh, what's this? I can't leave until I've caught... Okay, okay. Uh, oh. Oh, that's death, I guess. How do I get to this side, though? And up there. Hmm. Can we go... Oh, no, it just jumps down. Okay, fuck. Okay, so this is just uh, these two. Okay. So where did where did this little guy go? Mm. It was difficult enough to squeeze out of there. I don't think I could go. Okay, so some paths are blocked. Oh my goodness. How do I do this now? So there's one up there, right on the edge. I need to get him. 
me try go. I got yeah, I can't go through here anymore. Shit. Hmm. Oh my goodness. Did that open another way I could go? Not sure. Oh, that. But I think I fucked that up. Man, I had that rat. I had him. Oh, but no sweats. Now I can just go... I could just jump from that platform and I'll be right on top of him. Firstly though, go... Uh, this way. And onto the square one. Onto the other one. There we go. Oh, you got nowhere to go, rat. Hehe. <laughs> gotcha. Wait, so I've got all the uh, power cells. I've got all the energy. Time to go back. You did it! Three electronic storage pouches, and they're in perfect condition too. Good Catty, good William. Don't get too cocky. You may have to. Re you may have retrieved these power banks, but you're you, the one who scared them away in the first place. I can't be too proud of our companion. But there's a perfectly good cable here. Maybe we can use that as well. So cut cut that with the electric scissors. Nice. So we got the cable. Should be good to go now. I think I've got everything. Man, I'm enjoying this. Uh, I'm enjoying this a lot so far, man. It's so beautiful this game. The pixel art is just. It's, it's something else. It's another level. <laughs> and the whole cyberpunk uh, futuristic theme, I, I dig it. I dig it a lot. Alright, so cool. Let's replace this. Sweet, new cable. And now we should deposit all the, our parts here. For the wrist. And then we can swap the uh, the batteries here. There we go. This kind of power supply can only conduct energy when the sources are arranged in order from minimal to maximum. Okay, so is this another like puzzle here? Uh, can we swap the... Uh... Minimum... wait. Minimum to maximum, so I'm doing this the other way around. Hold on. Okay, so that one here. Let's swap these two around. These two as well. Oh, wait, what? Isn't this it? Well, I'm only I'm only missing one connection there. Maybe like this. No, I don't get how they are connected from the top. To the bottom. And this would make... What? How come this worked? It's from minimum to maximum, no? Yeah, this should be working. Hmm... Let me try and swap these two out.
I don't get how that middle one's not connecting to anything. Wait, what did he say? Leave this page. Uh... Oh, this just resets it. Oh, shit. Okay, hold on. Let me check what it says. Can only conduct energy when the sources are arranged in order to, in order from minimum minimal to maximum. Oh, okay. So the there's arrows pointing to the left. So I'm just gonna go minimal to maximum then. Swap these around. Oh, is that the number of bars? Is that important as well? Should that be here? Like, there's numbers on the bottom. Like, one, two, three, four. Maybe that's the amount of bars? Uh, quite possibly. Let me try... Wait. Let me just uh, re reset this. Wait. Oh, how do I reset it? Oh, I don't think I can anymore. Okay. God damn it. And these puzzles are hard, eh? Maybe it's just me. Alright, so we have five bars on number five, six bars on there, and then one. Like, how is this not working? What the fuck? Six bars on the six? I don't get it. Stop this two around. What am I missing here? What the hell? It should be, should be all good. Oh, did I? Uh, I think I reset it. Yeah. So oh, how? Hmm. So maybe they get... No, because these ones are not even transmitting to each other anymore. I don't get it. Why, though? So obviously this one's not transferring to this one because uh, it's power output. Like this? What's the difference if I uh, just transfer these ones, man? I, I don't get... There's only one missing. I don't see the logic in this uh, puzzle. I'm sorry. Maybe I'm uh, being too fake. I'm not sure. Oh, there's only, there's only one left. What the fuck? Ugh. No, that can't be right. Let's go back.
Or was it like this? Oh my goodness, dudes. This is what I had. Oh, I don't know. I... Any hoops. We got there at the end. <laughs> Took us a while. Now I'm ready to go. Fingers crossed this won't kill me. Beep, beep, beep. Wakey, wakey. It's time to get up. Damn, you're so nosy. What the hell are you doing, BBX? Do you want me to throw you back into the furnace? I need to carry out a routine checkup on your mechan <laughs> mechanical part. It's only for... It's four days overdue. Sure, whatever. Just wait for me there. I'll come to you. Okay, let's get this over with. Scanning body. Beep 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 warning. Beep 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 warning. The scan results shows that 98% of your mechanical parts are on the verge of failure. <laughs> are you going out of your minds? Did I didn't I just release recently have my knee changed? Don't blame me, blame the results. Maybe it's time for a thorough maintenance and repair. Don't even think about it. Maybe you and your faulty scanner are the ones who need maintenance. That's not a bad idea, actually. Do you, you do realize that you haven't changed any of my fittings for the past two years, right? It's already a miracle that I can still scan you at all. And you just... and just where... Am I going to find parts for a relic like you, the museum? I should probably donate you as an exhibition. Initiating self-destruct sequence. <laughs> Calm down, I'm kidding. Head upstairs to the workshop and I'll give you a quick checkup. Acquire new file, Rex. Missed detective agency. 2040, 10... Oh, couldn't read that fast enough. Got a poster that says, love me. Nice, very classy. So I guess this is our flat, and uh, we just played through the uh, prologue. Look at this, look how beautiful it is, man. And this is, that's the plague mask of the death character that was chasing us earlier, was wearing. Oh man, this looks so cool, honestly. I'll, I'll get through to uh, investigating all this on the next episodes. Right, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying and are looking forward to this game as much as I am. And uh, yeah, thank you for the support, guys. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.